welcome everyone and today i am back with another interesting video in this video i will show you how you can zip multiple folders in linux uh, before we start i would request you to subscribe to my channel for uh, further videos so let's start i have created a folder uh, called temp and inside that folder i have multiple directories in linux so let's uh, zip the directory in the usual way which is like uh, zip dash r for recursively if there are multiple directories inside the dir1 uh, then let's say we want to call it dir1.zip so i will write the target name first and then the target directory name that i want to zip okay because these are empty directories uh, they uh, can be done very quickly so now let's see if we have the zip of the directory and you can see that uh, we got the uh, zip of the directory uh, similarly we can um, unzip it by doing unzip and dir1 uh, and uh, we can press enter and it unzip I get rid of this dir1.zip and now let's say I want to zip all the directories in one go okay so to zip all the directories what I will do is I will use for loop. I will paste a code and this for loop will actually uh, perform the zipping of all these directories. So basically uh, this actually create the same kind of command. Uh, you can see that the directory name is appended with the dot zip and then here the directory name will come in every cycle. Uh, and in this will just uh, zip all these directories uh, one by one in one go so let's run it and you can see that all all the zips have been created uh, for the respective directories uh, in one case it might be that you just want to delete those directories uh, after each zip so for example if you zip dir1 into dir1.zip then you also want to delete this directory in the same space uh, because in recently i i came across a scenario where the hard disk space was not large enough to uh, zip all to save the zip of all the directories so after each zip i was um, deleting the original directory so to do this all you need to do is is just press up arrow to get this command and then here you can write rm-rf and then dollar i because in this cycle dollar i will have the current directory name and then semicolon now uh, let's control c let's first get rid of all the zips i think it will overwrite but anyway rm-rf star dot zip and now let's run this command